All right, I have a very simple Photoshop document, a uh, black background and a text layer with the word frozen on it. You can do some things with smart objects that you normally couldn't do if it weren't a smart object. For example, if I do a free transform on the text layer, you'll notice that most of these things are grayed out. However, if I convert this to a smart object, then do a free transform. You'll see I can do all of those. Let's play around just a, for a second. I'm going to go into the filter and stylize wind. Uh, wind from the right. Okay. And I think I'll do that once or twice more. All right, <clears throat> you'll notice that as a smart object, those become editable things with a layer mask there, which is awesome. Another thing that I can do is I can warp the text any way that I, any way that I desire there. When I set that in place, now, the other nice thing is since that is a smart object we can double click on this go in with our type tool and replace that text with another piece of text and all those things will be applied to it so that's one of the great things about smart objects in photoshop